Imagine how cool would it be to study one single degree and get access to numerous career opportunities. You could choose to become a director, producer, filmmaker, radio jockey, TV anchor. And all you'll have to do is study mass communication. Hello and welcome. Today on Heads Up, we'll find out how to kickstart a career in the world of media and communication. I was just seven when I did my first ODT competition and I remember how I used to watch those TV anchors and journalists on the screen. Ever since then I've grown up with a fascination for the media careers and I think I can just wait to be a journalist myself someday. Meet Tanya Talwar, an 8th grader from Amity International School, Delhi. Confident and buzzing with energy and enthusiasm, Tanya aspires to become a journalist someday. I've literally been spending two to three hours every day to work upon my oratory skills. I also make sure that I'm reading and writing along to enhance my vocabulary. A broad field of study, mass communication includes TV and print journalism, radio broadcasting, advertising and PR and the more recent online journalism. Speaking skills and writing skills come naturally to Tanya and are also skills necessary for both print and TV journalism. Tanya is among a million young Indians who aspire for media career. But what is it that really attracts them to this field? Let's find out. From writing stories for newspapers and websites to live reporting and anchoring for TV or spending countless hours of talking and entertaining over the radio, media professionals are on their toes most of the time. Despite being a demanding job, a media career is still highly sought after, evident in industry surveys and reports. If you look at the projections, it's a 13.9 percent projection and an annual you know average we are looking at and by 2019 say in another three years time we are looking at 1964 billion as against 1026 billion in 2014 that's amazing you see and i think that this is uh, this growth has got to do with the increasing purchasing power of the middle class, the growing income, uh, you know, we have been able to maintain the economic growth. There is an aspirational, you know, group coming up fast in our small centers, in our small urban centers, in our rural areas. Education in media and communication has also seen a rigorous transformation in the last two decades. Mass communication today has evolved into a specialized field expanding boundaries beyond journalism into areas like radio broadcasting and advertising and PR among others. Talk about popularity and mass communication tops the charts with the course attracting thousands of students every year with diverse educational backgrounds. I've been seeing you know, new media institutions mushrooming all over. So there is every, almost every university, every private university, every, you know, media institute, every new, in, uh, even management institutes are offering, you know, media related courses. In fact, I see a lot of newspapers and television channels opening up their own institutes. That shows the growing demand. That's a reflection of the growing demand. And even, you see, on an average for my institution, we receive on an average, say, around 5,000 applications for about 410 seats across the country. Masscom courses in India are offered at undergraduate and postgraduate levels as both a degree and a diploma. The eligibility criteria for admissions may vary according to the college of your choice, but a minimum qualification of 10 plus 2 stays compulsory. The course includes a study of topics like journalism, broadcasting, advertising and public relations among others. While classroom training equips students with an in-depth knowledge of these topics, internships on the other hand ensure a necessary industry exposure. They get a hands-on training during the internship. They learn the nitty-gritties and uh, the, you know, the important component of uh, working in the field. They learn how to report, they learn how to do good stories and when they are associated with some senior journalists, they learn the trick of the trade. Good communication skills including speaking and writing well along with critical thinking are some of the must-have skills for a mass communication student. 
Mass communication careers can be exciting and challenging at the same time and are also known to be diverse. From working in television space to radio or print or even online, MassCom students find a variety of career options to choose from. With Richa Sajatya, Sharon Alex, NDTV. So we are here at the Indian Institute of Mass Communication, New Delhi, and with me a couple of students, uh, all MassCom students, and they will share with us their experiences. So you earlier told us that you were an engineering graduate and now you're doing MassCom. Why leave engineering? And yeah, I feel that this is the only profession we where you get to know more about the world, and this is the only thing that if you do down the line in 20 years, and then you find that most of the things in the in the world you cover. So uh, this was that I uh, that appealed me always, and then I thought I should right. pursue it. And you are an engineering dropout, you know, like it's so interesting that you sort of you know leave other careers and come into mass communication. So what is the kind of exposure that you've seen, you know, which you did not get there and now in mass communication? Well, it was a bold move. It was a difficult decision to take. But then, you know, this is one profession where you are bombarded with so many new ideas, new perspectives of looking at things. You know, if I'm looking at something, I would not analyze it the way I do now. Right. I never did that, you know. Yeah. So it really exposes you to a lot of new information, new perspectives, how you can perceive things. So as a MassCom student, we work a lot with our language skills and communication skills. Mm -hmm. How do you sort of keep yourself upbeat with, you know, all of this? Like, it's it's such a struggle to write well and to speak well without flaws. How do we keep ourselves good with that? I think just keep reading because you kind of pick up on it, grows on to you. I mean, you can't read enough. You have to watch shows and you sort of pick from there. I mean, right. there's no alternative to reading. Right. So you say um, that writing and reading is the only option to yeah, keep yourself totally. right. Also, you know, uh, I want to ask to you, what do you think is the role of internship? From a student's perspective, how important do you think are internships and how do you sort of find good internships? There is a major role of internship in your profession ahead because in internship you learn how to go ahead with things and then in professional atmosphere, this is a classroom course, mm -hmm. then when you set, step down in a pro professional field, then you understand what is the need and demand of the market from you. Right. So, and about... Uh, Doing a good internship, I would say one should also keep focused on what is going down in the market. New media is coming, so where else apart from print or our uh, radio and television he can go. Right. So he should be vigilant in things and then he should apply as many places as he can. So to quickly wrap up this chat, you know, my last question to you is, if you had to motivate somebody to join mass communication, you know, what would you say to them? Uh, see, above everything else, you gain a perspective and mass communication, it just offers you different mediums to, you know, let that perspective out in the world. Mm -hmm. So that's the only thing I'd like. Would you like to say something? Uh, basically, something? if you want to join mass communication, the first thing is that uh, you must be ready to learn every day. You cannot, in this field, you cannot afford to say that I will not read today. I will not read the newspaper today or I will not watch the news. Well, that was a lot of valuable information uh, from these students here at IIMC. Super 93.5 Red FM पर मैं हूं आपके साथ है नाम मिडनाइट मसाला सुन रहे हैं आप यस हाय मैं हूं आरजे हिना और यू लिसन टू मी एवरी नाइट 9 पीएम फ्रॉम मंडे टू फ्राइडे ऑन सुपर एट्स 93.5 Red FM एंड द शो नेम इज मिडनाइट मसाला आई कंसीडर माय सेल्फ द मसाला क्वीन ऑफ दिल्ली आई नो इट्स अ वेरी बिग स्टेटमेंट बिकॉज़ व्हेनेवर यू आर अलोन इन द स्टूडियो That too, nine o'clock in the evening. You have the power. You have the microphone, and you are a Delhi ki ladki. I've done my radio jockeying from uh, Indian Institute of Mass Communication, and yes, I owe a lot to the institute because uh, I am a BCom graduate. I never thought I'll be doing uh, a show like this. That too in the capital city, but yes, I am doing it. Well, uh, I come to office uh, at around three o'clock in the afternoon. I'm a lazy girl, but not only lazy, I'm hardworking also. <laughs> so it isn't like uh, that. I have my show at uh, nine o'clock in the evening, so I'll reach office at eight thirty. That's a part time job. No, we work really hard for the show, and uh, yes, I come to office by three o'clock or four o'clock in the afternoon. So we plan the show. We have the team. I'm not the only one, you know, who's doing the whole show. <laughs> One thing that I often face is, you know, you can't sound fresh every time. But that's one challenge, and you have to overcome it. 
because uh, people you know they don't listen to you if you are you know if you're parishan or something like that they don't want to listen to you if you're bubbly if you have something interesting to tell them if you're attractive and uh, you have uh, that 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 punch in you then they want to listen to you and uh, people are so updated they know each and everything they are you know aware of everything so you have to be on your toes every time i think a uh, good voice is uh, very much important to be an rj plus you should be responsible if you have good voice you should be responsible you just cannot say anything on the microphone you should sound responsible you should not hurt anybody's sentiments uh, you should be witty and uh, you should have a good pronunciation holding the language is one important thing uh, personal connect is much important because uh, people call me because they know i connect to them they know she will understand me she will you know try to resolve my problems so you should have that personal connect with the listeners spontaneity you know zulmi ye hazir jawabi hogi that's very important because you get a lot of calls aur wahan pe you have to tackle them Uh, well, I think if you don't want to be a radio jockey, you can be. Uh, if you're good at writing, you can be a copywriter, and if you have a good taste of music, you can be a music producer. Uh, you can be a sound engineer, and you can be a show producer. Uh, well, I'll say just be yourself, be original. Because if you'll try to copy somebody, that'll be for I guess maximum one week. अपनी originality आई जाती है. So I guess just be original. relaxed and people will love you the way you are it's time for us to slip into a short break we'll be right back with lots more on mass communication careers